Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Audio Tips. In today's tutorial, I opened you guys up the R Decessor, uh, DSer. Sorry, that's what that's what we're gonna that's how we're gonna pronounce it. In this tutorial, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you guys a little overview on the plugin. Uh, kind of talk to you guys about what it does. This is mostly for beginners or new users to Pro Tools and the Waves plugins. Um, Keep in mind that you do have to have certain Waves plugins in order to open some of these plugins that I am opening. They do not come with Pro Tools. Uh, Pro Tools has its own plugins. So if you guys want, you guys can go onto Waves, uh, download a trial for some of these plugins that you guys are in have interest in. Download them, try them out, and if you like them, you end up purchasing them. But a DSer is usually used to take out the s s sounds, the sibilant sound in your vocal. So um, what you do is you go to Range, you know. How much range you want on the uh, want to take away from the sibling sound and threshold is the point in which it occurs. So basically, guys, all you're looking at is these two knobs. You guys can sweep the frequency spectrum, but you guys, uh, it's not really gonna make a difference because it just takes out the high frequencies. The sibling is usually around um, 6k and up. So what you guys want to do is just take take away the range of it, put the threshold uh, to a point in which you want it to occur at. And take away the range, and you guys will start to hear the S, the S sound go away. But that's basically it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys for watching. Later on in the future, I will show you guys how to use this on a on a really sibilancy uh, vocal. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and please subscribe.